Hello, Carl here with Sustainability Theory News. We're over at the Small Farmers Journal, defending small farms and craftsmanship since 1976. Rice is a new staple crop for very cold climates. This is talking about farms in Vermont, but uh, I'm in Michigan and a lot of other farms in uh, southern Canada could grow rice as well. You know, any place where there's a low lane water table where you could build rice paddies, and here's a good picture of a few rice paddies right here that are terraced as it goes downhill. And there's, of course, great, beautiful, awesome, mag I don't know what, what to say, entire mountains carved with rice paddies in China. But in colder climates, it's possible using wild rice varieties, and that will command a higher price at market. In local staple crops, wheat, uh, you know, rice, they're coming back because commodities crops, milk, corn, soybean, it's a little harder to get through that system. Food distributors are driving down costs. I mean, milk, for instance, and that's what this article is built around, is a lost leader in a lot of these grocery stores. So they're constantly trying to squeeze that price down as low as possible. Dairy farming is a very low profit margin business, whereas heirloom crops and heirloom staples it's a small percentage of the market it's a niche market but it's a high margin market it's a high profit market so it might be worth looking at if you're looking to diversify your growing portfolio well anyway that's it for this story you can follow the link in the description below if you like to read more about it and if you like to see more headlines like this on youtube subscribe to my channel have a great day